In the field of shadows Where flowers stand like trees By the cover of a willow down on his knees He buried all of his hopes and dreams there beside the quiet stream and waited for the summer to make him The shovel in his sore hands He dug a hole so deep And he took his dream plants And sat them down to sleep The secret thought they all went down buried in the stony ground. Oof. We just went on a little driving adventure. Like every single street in Riviera Grande is uh, one way. So it took us extraordinarily long to get here, but I hope it'll be worth it. We're going to a liquor museum factory store. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow. Liquor made from milk. Salto de Cabras, which is jumping goats, and it's a waterfall, and it's just a wee little bit of a hike down here. It's definitely close to the waterfall because we can hear it. These things are not in the U.S. No, not at all. Neither is this brown color, which is so cool. was not worth it. <laughs> so apparently there's there's a dam and a whole bunch of noise so this might be like a, a power station or something. Okay so it definitely is a hydroelectric plant. And apparently the waterfall is just up this way, not down the other way. Oh, there's the waterfall. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yes. <laughs> The steak, it's absolutely amazing. <laughs> How is it? It is so good, but the name of it is really weird and creepy. It's called Bride's Bed Cream. Well, we just said goodbye to the Azorian Urban Lodge and our stay there was fantastic. We loved it. We are going to be taking my mom to the airport later today and then we'll be moving into our second location, which is also in Ponte Delgada. Um, but I have no idea where, so the adventure continues. <laughs> Breakfast. Bigger island, bigger pastries. Man, I'm glad we're not on that thing. <laughs> what a different experience. I'd like to try it someday. Not today. <laughs> the thing is, it's a skyscraper that fell over and floated. No, it's a city. It's an entire city. <laughs> yeah, it's an entire city. That just pulled up to the city. <laughs> so happy that my mom came to visit us. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah, that was really special and wonderful. We, it was nice because this time when we say goodbye, we'll be seeing her next week <laughs> when we head home to Baltimore for, for the month of May. So it wasn't such a hard goodbye. <laughs> And we've still got a week here in Sao Miguel for us. Um, so we're going to go stay at a hostel now and check in and everything, get all settled in and then uh, see what time it is. So now we are on our way to a place to change my phone plan because the plan I have sucks. It's uh, Meo, M-E-O, which literally in Spanish, that exact word means piss. <laughs> and it... It is. <laughs> and MJ Sailing, they told us about this other plan called Vodafone, which is really good. And they have it here and we need it because we've been going around this island all this time and for whatever reason, no internet. Even though it says we have full bars of 3G and 4G and all that, it, it just, it stinks. So we need internet because our next hostel, we have no idea where it is. So we need GPS to get there. Big island, it's got some big towns. And it's got a mall. And we haven't been in a mall in a really long time. We and need to go to the mall for the phone. Yeah. So we went to lunch at the food court because we haven't been in a food court in a long time. And we went to Pizza Hut. There are tiny slices of pizza though. a really amazing day planned. We are going to begin with a hike on the far southeastern 
corner of the island, and then we're going to go to these incredible hot springs in the center of the island. So, lots of fun in store today. I'm really excited. Time to begin the hike. This one's uh, Sanguino. Maybe? Sanguino. It's five point... It's 4.5 kilometers. Yeah, and this is trail oh, number pretty. nine. And it's... Yes. You just... I'll shut up. You look. And we've just started this trail, and it's amazing. Oh, wow, it just gets better. So we're just going up this hike for a long time, and then out of nowhere, chickens! <laughs> Many chickens! She didn't know. Maddie loves to paint chickens. I just love chickens. She, yeah, she loves chickens. Her favorite chicken is the silky chicken, which is why when we saw that silky chicken in Florida, she, like, we had to go see the silky chicken. But this is so awesome. All these chickens are following us. We don't know why. We haven't given them given them any food. Uh, you know, tourists probably give them food. Oh yeah, probably. And, <laughs> and since we haven't yet, <laughs> they're coming for it. Maddie, how's it feel to be surrounded by chickens? I'm so happy. Hey there, chicken. Seriously, like, they're all just here. We left the chickens. Oh, wow. Careful there. into the town and the modern town contemporary town is down far down where we parked our car but this is just so picturesque and beautiful
the second pool. And I'm gonna show you this awesome part of Procyon, our, our hostel. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like, subscribe, and share this video with your friends. And if you'd like to follow our journey in real time on a map, receive postcards from our ports of call, and message us directly to the boat, you can go ahead and become a patron using the link in the description down below. Yes. Oh. Yes. Oh, I hear pew pews. A little baby chick somewhere. Yes.